update your save files please before i hop in to my mercury retrograde rant uh just want to let you guys know that i have an etsy shop not only um is it you know just a regular schmegular etsy shop it's actually for tarot so you guys remember when i did that tarot reading for the sims 4 oh my god well my etsy shop is called twin fish tarot because Pisces girl and I have one sale. I literally got my first sale yesterday and I'm literally so excited and I'm just even more motivated now um, to keep going. So check it out if you want to get a reading from me. Um, it's it's on the cheaper side, so I guess. I don't know. I just realized I've been looking at the wrong camera. Fuck. But judging at the title, you're probably like, this bitch is so stupid. She is literally the dumbest piece of shit I've ever seen in my life. You're correct you're correct so if you're not into like astrology and the planets and shit mercury is in retrograde and when mercury is in retrograde basically it kind of looks like like mercury is going backward like rotating around no fuck fuck it looks like mercury is orbiting reverse in the sky instead of you know the right way and it's kind of like an optical illusion or whatever um and with mercury retrograde comes technical issues and deleting things that you didn't mean to delete and there's this one save file that I have been playing literally since I started my channel and that was Antonia's Legacy and if y'all remember her oh my god real OGs like my game was lagging a lot <laughs> and so I was like how about I do a hard reset on my computer? Mistake number one. Mistake number one. And so what I did was I copied all my, I copied the save file and put it into Google Drive. And then I copied um, my custom content folder and put it into my Google Drive as well. So I had Antonia still there and all my CC because I didn't feel like redownloading um, all my CC. And I was like, all right, cool. I've done this before. Like I'm gonna, I, I should have double checked. So I hard, I literally hard reset my PC. It took five hours. Like it was really long. Um, I hate technology. I, oh my God, I fucking hate it. And so I'm like, it, it gets done. It finishes. And I'm like, yay, I have a fresh new PC. My game's going to be all smooth and not laggy. And I download The Sims 4 and uh, she's not there. The save is not there. I'm like, what do you mean? I have spent months working on this fucking legacy family that you know i wanted to have for a long time and and they're gone they're gone i mean i still have antonia and theo in my gallery um but not in my game and none of their children like they just don't exist anymore so i thought for i mean newcomers are welcome um there's a lot of tea but i thought that uh for my you know original original uh you know og antonia fans i thought we could go through google drive and uh take a walk down memory lane because i took so many screenshots um like literally that was, there's so much so here we are in my google drive uh here's the saves folder and the mods folder where everything went wrong but i have this whole folder chuck pool of freaking screenshots and i love them so much because like some of them have like crazy stories of them and it's just really bad like all right i'm gonna be honest uh there is lsd and heroin involved so I don't have a lot of earlier pictures of Antonia. Literally, the only pictures I have are when she's like with Theo. But let's see, I saw some of her like younger pictures. Oh my lord. This was Antonia and then that was Arthur, our main man. So basically, oh my god, she's so pretty. She is so freaking pretty. I actually like made Arthur for Antonia to fall in love with and then she fell in love with somebody else. <laughs> Ooh, I literally got so fucking fed up with this man because he kept just falling. Like he would fall every five seconds. And I'm like, please just stop. Like, you know, when your Sims fall and everybody's laughing at them, they're like, ha ha, you fell. Like, stop. It's not that funny. Um, <laughs> but let's see. Oh my gosh, Bentley. Bentley. Okay, so Bentley was Antonia's dog, and Arthur actually gave Antonia Bentley. And uh that was kind of awkward because it was like it was like Arthur was trying to win over her heart by getting her a dog for her birthday. And then she, you know, found somebody else which yeah that's fun here's the old house oh my god i built this house i was actually really proud of it but yeah if y'all like don't know what's going on please well okay please don't because the audio quality was really bad and the video quality too <coughs> but antonia basically was adopted and she was pretty much trying to find her birth mother the, ho the whole time but then i kind of changed the storyline and now she has or had uh, a bunch of kids um and they all have their different stories and it's just really sweet here's their first oh my god i love this picture it's he it's them right here like laying up and looking at the stars oh my the waterfall aesthetic 
aesthetic it's just so like crazy to me too how we just use like we get so attached to these you know characters that don't even exist and i am really happy that like the sims has kind of gotten better with like you know likes and dislikes and stuff like that there is a lot more that needs to be added um and it kind of sucks that uh it took so long but you know i'm glad that things are going in a better direction i'm still i'm honestly surprised that like the sims 5 hasn't been um at least hinted at yet or announced by ea um but let's see Ooh, this this is uh, Antonia's eldest child, Javier. Um, and he's really cool. This is actually when Antonia had her last kid. Oh my god. <laughs> Bitch is floating. Holy shit. I love that picture. But <laughs> this is when Antonia had her last kid and it was actually like... So here's like a storytelling tip or like a suggestion. Don't have like Sims pregnancies always go smoothly. Like Antonia actually had trigger warning. She actually had um, a miscarriage a couple times before she had Javi. Um, and you don't necessar necessarily need a mod for that. Like you can just kind of play it out and in your head and stuff like that but she had a miscarriage and then her last kid gabriel was actually like the pregnancy just didn't really go well and she thought she literally thought gabriel was gonna pass away um but he did it uh he's alive and well well i guess they're all kind of dead now i want to find the picture where they were doing drugs where is the picture where they were doing drugs i have i have to find it i have to show you guys where ah ah uh, yes <laughs> What's up, Theo? He was high. He was so high. Um, he was also extremely high in this, as you can see, the red eyes. And this has got to be one of my favorite pictures because um in base mental drugs mod, <laughs> when they when they're high on LSD, they get like little like swirlies around their head and they don't look straight. <laughs> if you don't have base mental, I highly recommend it. Okay, here's Theo ar like arguing with his dad and he's high as crap. Oh my god, it's just so fun. Like I love it. Um, let's see. Aw, oh, this oh, this is when I got my new PC. Like, look how good, like the I'm sorry, like look how good the graphics look. Like I had a really awful PC, so my graphics weren't really the best, but this is when I use like really like cool reshade presets. And here's Antonia, which she looks so so cute. Um, this is actually uh when she had her miscarriage and they had like a little memorial, and it was really sweet. I actually cried. Like, isn't it crazy how the Sims like just makes us cry? Um, this is also one of my favorite pictures love it so much and then this is when they found their wedding venue so freaking cute i love doing stuff like that it's it's literally so fun um just kind of like role playing that out in your head i guess uh but are there any more funny ones are all are all these just like really cute and and normal <laughs> because the drug ones were not here's a here's delaney uh one of antonia's kids she she was gorgeous like she's probably one of the most gorgeous sims i've ever had um that was her too uh uh, here's Theo Cat. Oh, pff. when was this? I'm telling you, Javi was like, he was drinking a lot. He was throwing up a lot too. Oh, here's um uh, Delaney's room that I made. This was also one of my favorite rooms that I've ever had for a sim. Um, I just loved it. I love the decorations and the lights and all that stuff. Um, because I'm usually not a big decorator in the sims usually i'm trying to find the pictures where they went to um, mount kamarebi because i had just gotten um snowy escape and i wanted to take them to a vacation there but i don't i don't think i have any pictures which really sucks because that was a really fun vacation let's see oh here's when she had red hair she was oh my god she was so cute look at her like probably one of my favorite sims i've ever met how many screenshots are there oh my god this is a favorite too this is a favorite too i love how she looks i love her hair for some reason it looks really like 3d in this that hair where's the oh here's mount kamarebi okay let's let's go through memory lane shall we here's theo figuring out where he's going and let's take a, pic a picture javier's probably falling in antonia uh she got them eyes she got she got the eyes there's delaney on her sled um that's theo and antonia just kind of enjoying their night so so cute um this is when i love the jogging aspect um on the trails in snowy escape and they were jogging together and stuff here's when uh delaney almost fell well actually she did if i remember correctly but i loved these pictures from the trip it was absolutely gorgeous especially because i got my new pc so everything just looked really really good um that's delaney and javi when they were young this is antonia's 
uh, bookstore that she actually opened. Um, if you guys do remember, she was like really into books and writing and stuff. Oh my gosh, I took so many pictures. This was not a good time. This was when they actually went on a picnic date. I used like the picnic mod or whatever, which was, oh my God, it was so cute. Oh, I love this picture too. Oh my God, they were so young. Antonia has gray hair now. Like it's just insane. I'm telling you guys, take pictures, take pictures of your Sims family um, because you never know. Uh, especially during Mercury retrograde, they might disappear on you. This was the wall they had of like their wedding photos and engagement photos. I think that's all I wanted to kind of look at. I mean, just looking through these makes me emotional, but I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to cry. This was their first, uh, what is it called? Baby shower, I think, for Javi when she was still pregnant with him. Um, oh my gosh, I love this picture too. I just love this whole family and I wanted to commemorate them with a little video, but I think that's going to be all because <laughs> if, I, if I keep scrolling, I'm, I'm going to be sad. Don't forget about checking out my Etsy shop Twin Fish Tarot. If you guys are into that, I will definitely give you a reading if you're down but that's going to be it from me. I will catch you guys later. Bye.